and good afternoon. I am back again. I am standing in, uh, in front of the Wisconsin Railroad Circus Train that was that pulled the circus of Barnum and Bailey, Ringling Brothers. This place is really cool. It's got all kinds of figurines. As you can see, here we go. Got the massive train car. Oh, you can't walk through it, or you scared. Oh, you can't walk through it. There, I wish. You cannot walk through it, unfortunately. But, uh, here are some of the carvings of animals. That was a thing. Wood carving shop. There's Debbie. And of course, the camel. Yeah, over there. that performed in the circus. Between clowns, actors, actresses. It's a lot of people. Even monkeys. John, who suggested the brothers purchase Bonner and Bailey. Following 1926, of Charles and John, the last of the brothers, who brought the circus winter quarters to Sarasota. Huh. It's a horse with some long hair. Joanna Park. Big top. sword and shield. Beefy buffalo. Step right up. Oh, yeah. This is the cannon that the Zucchini's super repeating cannon. This is where they launch humans out of a cannon on top of a truck. They're there, they load the human inside the cannon, inside here, and they press a lever inside the truck, and then kaboom. In the ladder, they do this back here.
Or no, sorry, they load the human in there. Oh, jeez. There's no one in there. They have the different posters, like the chicken man. Uh, the... Big Jim, the Texas Giant. Peter to the Lady. Albino family. And the three-legged man. All right, yeah, we can go out there. And look inside the Wisconsin. This is the big wagon, one of the big wagons that was pulled uh, for traveling. There's all the different wheels that they use all throughout the, cent the century and decades. This is... All right, so I'm gonna look up in the Wisconsin, in the Wisconsin train car, and let's look inside it. Can't go in it, but we can look inside it. And to see what it looks like while traveling. I imagine with the John's. Uh, it was a nice, comfortable luxury. Although the cars, see, the cars were very small compared to <laughs> now. Uh, so I'll start with the beginning. So this is the private office. Of course the private here uh, always had the bigger had the bigger room. And they got uh, he's got a table, I mean he's got just a chair and lounging. An old record player. Please leave a comment down below in this video if you own one of these. A uh, record player. Uh, this is uh, and of course as you go from the private area you go into smaller rooms other bunkers and different parts of the train and the rooms get smaller and smaller a tiny tiny potty toilet a really small toilet <laughs> This must be a, oh, this is a special bathroom. A bat, big bathtub, sort of. This is one of the bathrooms. And does each one have a bathroom? This is... This looks like one in another room. I don't know if they actually share a bathroom. Or if they just... I think they share a bathroom. That made fun. Ew. This looks like a lounge area, maybe a kitchen. Or like a playing card area. Here you got the. This looks like the kitchen. It would be a kitchen when they cook food and all that stuff. I uh, got the sinks to wash dishes. Ice cooler down there. That's like. So the kitchen. This would be the kitchen. Because there would be different trains. Kitchen. Um, what room is this? Private rooms. Uh, lounging. This is probably lounging. Office. So. So that basically was uh, the Wisconsin. And just to give you an idea of what train travel was like during the 
uh, during the circus, uh, days of the circus. And so, uh, we made it through both museums, uh, pretty quicker than I thought it was, I think. But really, actually, it was really good timing, because I also needed to change the batteries in my camera, because they ran out. So, uh, don't forget, uh, do leave a like on this video, definitely get a big thumbs up, and, uh, comment, uh, down below what, uh, what places I should go to next, and, uh, either museum, historical places, uh, anywhere else, I know. Yeah, we're just kind of winding down here now, so it's quite a place. Well, thanks for coming to visit. Thank yeah. you. That was, that was very interesting. It was very interesting. I know that. Good. Um, not, I mean, mm -hmm. I, I don't know. It was just knowing about the circus and what it was and now what it is today. Not very many people know about the circus today than they used to when they went out all the time. When the circus came to town, it was like a big event. So. Well, thank you very much. All right, so that was the two, uh, uh, two uh, circus museums. I really wanted to see basically the two museums. Uh, now I'm gonna go find some food because I'm very, very hungry. I'm gonna, I'm gonna definitely stop at Chick Fil A probably. Get me a, oh, give me a frosted coffee. It sounds really good. Um, but don't forget, like this channel. Uh, uh, well, like this video. Subscribe to my channel at. Uh, spin v2 and uh don't forget to press a like definitely subscribe uh leave comments uh places uh like to, me to go to uh, any other museum historical places and uh i will for sure to try to get there uh as quickly as i can uh any other places in florida i know there are some places on my list that I want to go to uh, to do some uh, videos for for my channel and we'll see you all in the next video